hello friends uh, this is a model bridge now i will show you how to apply light load wind load and dead load for light load go to loads and then select types first of all vehicle vehicles so <coughs> select here vehicles right here corner arrow and it will pop up like this and you have to select again import vehicle so select so this is coming select ok now it will now it's showing here vehicles and then again you have to go vehicle classes so all are there now you have to go to load patterns so <coughs> this csi bridge or to be generated this that load so eight new load pattern okay that load is already here so you can for light load give the name is light light load say so select type as vehicle type add load button and again then again you have to go to modify load pattern modify light load so this is the we have only one lane in this model bridge so these are the vehicles ira irc you can select, select any one for me so starting first for first vehicle i am selecting two vehicles so first first vehicle i am giving a speed as say 50 uh, direction is forward 8 and second is i am giving starting time after first vehicle say 5 seconds and speed is 48 8 then ok ok so you have to give it as time history so go to analysis see here this is the date model this these are created by this csip and live load this is the case just we have created now we have selected time history so started click here it will pop up so you have to select from this one say i'm giving giving the name as time screen okay these are the analysis type linear non-linear model i'm selecting as model and load pattern add and like load as add then okay so Thus, live load is now complete. Complete. So, go for analysis. This is for dead load, model load, live load, and time history. You can see here. These are the cases, live load cases. now for wind load and dead load i'm selecting exit plan select the point on which you want to keep the loads
so I'm giving this point selecting this nodes and go to advanced joins joins uh, 